Because if we do want to get into all segments, then we will fail. So <laughs> good. That, that is that will never happen. So we want to see where we are good at, and uh, we will only want to complement the work that others are doing. And we do not want to compete. I think uh, if we go into a competitive mode, then uh, the overall objective will not be met. At the bottom of the pyramid, there's a lot of good work that has been doing, and uh, we are trying to follow up and see how things are moving forward. And I think uh, for us, uh, rather than we saying how it should be done, I think uh, we need to learn from you mm. how you have done it, and then see what are the elements that we can bring in to tweak certain things that would be helpful and beneficial. Because at that point, uh, I don't think uh, we should be saying that this is how it should be done. We still have to gain a lot of knowledge and uh, expertise that uh, is there in the field, and then only move forward. Yeah, competition business approach this is not a competition. It is a monopoly. 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 Uh, free market man, that overlapping that that is possible. So we need to see why maybe there is an overlap that we can avoid. Because at the end of the day, we need to give choices to the consumer. So if your choice, there must be services and product that goes along. And in, in our sphere of the work, what we believe in is selling a product is not the end of the story. The, our learning is that the service element is where people are lacking. And that is where we want to be strong at. Even on the delivery 